If you have a Netflix subscription, you have probably seen the show Coco Melon when scrolling for new shows. Now, the kids' show has become a hit amongst children across the world. And here with why is Emmy Award winning journalist Liliana Vasquez. Welcome back to ISF, Lil. Good to see you too. I'm so excited to be here and Happy New Year. Liliana, what did Coco Melon's research find at the top of the list for parents who are really wanting to establish healthy habits? Well, I think the best part of this research is that parents realize we are not alone, you guys. It is hard out there, okay? And 74% of parents, like myself, think that establishing routines with their children can feel like a battle, especially around things at the end of the day. Like for us, bath time and bedtime can just be a natural challenge because I'm tired, my husband is tired, my son is tired. But there is hope thanks to some of our children's favorite TV characters and songs, and that is Coco Melon, right? By using songs and nursery rhymes as a tool to help children really follow good routines around those things that can be really hard. And Coco Melon really teaches children these songs and these nursery rhymes that help them implement successful routines, whether it's bath song or eating your vegetables or first day of school, all of these songs help establish routines that make life easier for parents, but also make that learning process easier for our children. And also the moments that you're having together as a family are also creating memories together through Coco Melon. It's so cool to see. What other insight, Liliana, did they find? Well, I think also that, you know, parents feel like kids can learn just good life habits from these characters on TV shows. And I always say the beautiful thing about Coco Melon is the Coco Melon ecosystem goes far beyond just watching the show on television. There's incredible STEM toys, there's books, for us, it's the music. That was my family's introduction to Coco Melon. So when we're in the car, we're learning the songs. My son is singing along to them. He's developing verbal knowledge just by learning the letters through the song. So it's really about finding what brings your family together. And for us, it was the songs and the books long before it was ever the show on YouTube or on Netflix. So it's really wonderful. And it also grows with your child. These are fabulous tips. I, I know that they are young parents and parents like watching right now here in Miami that have probably been searching for these tips and ways to really just cultivate better habits. As you said, time management is huge for my brother who just had a baby. He's like Ugh, figuring out how to make things come to fruition in a timely manner with the kids is always, always a, a struggle. Where can we go for more information? Well, what I love is engaging with the Coco Melon community. You're going to find parents that are like minded, going through the same struggles that you're going through and whether it's Instagram or TikTok, there is a community there waiting for you to teach you all kinds of parenting hacks, ways to really engage your little ones through learning. And it also, for me, makes me feel like I'm not doing this alone and I'm not the only one struggling. Right, community is so important. Emmy award-winning host and television personality, Liliana Vasquez. Again, wonderful having you back here with us on Inside South Florida and South Florida. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. It's good to see you.